new details tonight about a controversial idea to let undocumented immigrants get driver's licenses. The new station's Robert Guadarrama is live. Robert. Charles, Heather, the two bills were filed in Tallahassee this week. We've told you about it, but here's why you should care. Accidents happen all the time on Florida roads. One of the first questions for those involved is, does the other driver have insurance? A proposed bill hopes to cut down on the odds the driver doesn't by allowing undocumented immigrants to obtain a driver's license. What's important, though, is that we give them access to a driver license. That way they can qualify to get car insurance. That way we can have them safely driving on our roads, which protects everyone from uninsured accidents. Plus, Representative Carlos Smith says insurance premiums could fall because the likelihood of getting into a wreck with an uninsured driver would drop. And just like everyone else, undocumented drivers would have to go through all the steps to qualify for a license. To assure that they know what the safe driving laws are in the state of Florida, that there's nothing on their record that restricts them from being able to have a driver license. Representative Smith feels confident the proposal will get the support needed. But the chairman of the Orange County Republican Executive Committee disagrees. Driving in the United States of America is a privilege, not a right. And it's insulting to the American people to say, well, let's give someone a privilege that is reserved for American citizens when these folks aren't American citizens to begin with. The bills have yet to be heard in any committee. We'll keep you posted. Live in Orange County, Robert Guadarrama, Fox 35 News.